Hey guys, how are you guys doing? Uh, this is Kensuke. I'm just here to do a quick demonstration on how to basically use Clip Studio's new um, color auto coloring feature. Uh, this is a new coloring feature that uh, Clip Studio recently introduced uh, about a couple weeks ago, and I haven't really seen that many video tutorials done about it, so I thought I'd give it a shot. Uh, so here I have my original layer. It's a black and ink character that I created. And what I'm going to go and do is designate this as my reference layer here. We can click on this little tiny button here. Um, and I'm going to create another layer on top of it, a blank layer. I'm going to go ahead and click edit. Um, Colorize Technology Preview, and I'm going to select the first one saying Colorize All, and what it's going to do is, it's going to think, 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 and not do it. <laughs> Let's try that again. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, target. Reference. Alright. Edit. Colorize. Colorize the wall. Think, 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 think. There we go. Um, so I made a quick mistake here, guys. You're not supposed to create a separate layer. Clip Studio will, will automatically do it for you, which is fantastic. But as you can see, I didn't specify or designate a single color whatsoever, and it did a pretty darn good job in assigning these colors. To, to my black and ink drawing. Uh, now there's gonna be a couple areas which I wanna have to go back and correct. You know, for example, between the wires here, I want that to be blank, uh, white. Um, here it went and filled in those shapes, but yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's pretty darn good. I mean, especially for the first time around. I mean, let's look at it closely here. I mean, I don't think I have to, I want to see, I want to try to do something here. I'm going to see it, it even took away the gaps. There's no, um, gaps between, uh, the lines that, uh, between each color that you would normally see if you choose them, if you selected the magic wand. Uh, this is great. Um, so that's that. Uh, next time I'm going to go ahead and show you a different way of coloring it using a, um, um, your, if there are certain colors that you want to use as opposed to getting something that's automatically used. So hope you enjoyed this tip. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, next time, if you like to, if you like what you see, please hit the like or the subscribe button. Thanks.